oh my gosh, I'm going to cry about this right now. I feel like I've ruined my face. <laughs> the panic is real. The micro, the micro blade panic is real. I'm trying really hard not to panic. It's been about eight hours since I had my brows microbladed. Ashley told me the brow would darken. <laughs> it's pretty dark. Okay, Scott, this is the first visual of the brow. What do you think? And so uh, it look it has a little bit of red to it and the brown. It's very sharp. I, I think it's it's just a little angry bird. <laughs> look to it. <laughs> I look like an angry bird. <laughs> One of the nice ones. And I can't even look at myself. I look ridiculous. I look like Robbie Rotten from Lazy Town. <laughs> reject from JLo's backup dancers. <laughs> Look how much RBF I have now. Like here's my regular face in repose. Just like, but like with these brows, they look like I'm going to come kill you and your whole family. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. I'm kind of stressing out. And they told me that they would darken and I would get stressed out. But like, I was not prepared for like, the statement that is this eyebrow. Look at it. It's like it's it's got its own personality. It's gonna like it's gonna like run for Senate. <laughs> look at it. I look like Groucho Marx. I look like I'm gonna walk up to somebody with my brow and just like these little knives are gonna come out and cut you up like wha bam eyebrow Brianna talked me into this I blame you Brianna why did you do this to me how could you I thought you were my friend what am I gonna do <laughs> oh no I can't even look at him I'm so surly I look like I look like I'm gonna be like Okay, so I'm going to my first public place with the brows. They do look better today than they did yesterday. They're definitely not as thick as they were. <laughs> They're still pretty dark though. Uh, Clyto, tell everybody what you think of mommy's brows. You can't have those eyebrows, Mandy. They make you look like a man. Because, like, if you took the word man and put it, it with D. Like, man D. So, it is day three of what I now like to call eyebrow gate. I went and dropped my kids off at school this morning and wore these glasses because my eyebrows are a catastrophe. And these are the only sunglasses I had tall enough to hide my shame. They are so dark. I look like a Russian villain. I look like Scooby-Doo and the gang are gonna like unmask me and I'm gonna be like, ooh, at the carnival, okay? That's where it's at. <laughs> I look like a caricature of myself. And yesterday I thought, okay, well, maybe if I put like a lot of eye makeup on or something like that, that it will like take away from the intensity of the eyebrow. So I put some eye makeup on and then it wasn't enough. So I put more eye makeup on. And then in the end, I just ended up looking like a lunatic with a backpack full of dead kittens. That's like driving to the pharmacy to pick up their 19 Valium prescriptions. I feel like I don't even look like myself. I look like I'm like gonna be in a soap opera. Like, like I, I threw like, like a telenovela where I threw some lady down the stairs and I'm just like, -ah 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 -ah. I look like Mr. Wooly. <laughs> like somebody left too much wool on my eyebrow. Like I'm Mr. Wooly. It's like someone just straight up stenciled that on there. <laughs> so 
permanently on my face. It's permanent. It's permanently on my face. I think that I'm just gonna wear these glasses like all the time. So if you're wondering who the psychopath is in the cat glasses,